What's up everybody, Joshua Lawrence back with you guys for another tutorial using DaVinci Resolve Lite. One of the problems I ran into when I first installed DaVinci Resolve Lite on my 13-inch MacBook Pro, I have found out that the user interface of DaVinci Resolve Lite is so large that it doesn't even fit my 13-inch MacBook Pro. Now, me using DaVinci Resolve 8 on my studio computer, I don't have a problem with it because I'm using a 27-inch monitor, but for here, um, as you guys can see, there's so much that's being cropped off that's missing. Uh, all over here, um, I'm not getting any of this stuff. And when I actually put it to a regular size, you know, this is what I'm seeing. Now, there is a workaround for this for people who um, are using MacBook Pro 13-inch or 15-inch. And I'm going to show you guys how to do it. Now, this isn't for everybody, but this is for the people who need to figure out how to make it work with their computer. Go up to your spotlight in the right corner, and you're going to want to type in Terminal hit enter and I'm going to give you guys a value below in the description that I want you guys to copy and I, I want you guys to actually paste so I'm going to paste my value in here now originally the user interface size would be a 1 as you guys can see here it would be a 1 that's the regular size of DaVinci Resolve Lite when you open it up on your 13 inch MacBook uh, MacBook Pro now what we're going to want to do is we're going to want to scale that down to actually make it fit our screen. So what we're going to do is instead of a 1, we're going to make it smaller and we're going to type in 0 0.67. Once we type in 0 0.67, we're going to hit enter. Once we hit enter, we're done. So what we do is we now open up DaVinci Resolve again. And once it opens up, you will actually see that now DaVinci Resolve will be able to fit my screen and there we go I'm using a 13 inch MacBook Pro right here and as you guys can now see the whole user interface actually fits in my screen so now when I log in to my administrative account I now have access to my configuration, my browse, my conform, uh, my color window, the viewer and everything else DaVinci has to offer so that's a workaround for you guys. Um, if you guys are using a MacBook Pro 15 inch, I would encourage you to play around with the value at the end. Um, I would say a MacBook Pro 15 inch, try 0 0.75. Um, and I've never heard anything yet about the 17 inch not working. So um, this is for basically people who are using a 13 and 15 inch. So um, here you go. Um, if you guys have any questions, you guys can email me at ijoshualawrence at live.com. Um, until the next tutorial. I am out. See ya.